Hi, right, today we're going to chat about the crop and the ratios and the sizes for Instagram and optimizing your image quality. I have a variety of images which I want to use today, um, nature and people. You can see them down the bottom here. So first things first we can look at is the original crop for uh, Instagram is the square crop. So that is a one-on-one -on -one, um, crop. And you can see you can shift it around. Uh, you can make unique uh, types of compositions. You can use just about everything and anything. So let's have a look. Let's try another one here, one-on-one. Uh, -on -one. So there, I mean, uh, it's pretty simple, pretty easy. Um, the next step for those using Lightroom would be to export this file or resize it. Now, uh, it's very important to remember with using it for Instagram, I've created some presets here. For a square, you're going to use on the long edge 1080 pixels. That's the optimum pixel size for the width. So um, yeah, I would export that. I've limited my file size to 500 KB. Um, quality is more than adequate for me at that stage. So um, we can click on export and it will go through to my desktop and there it is over there. We can have a look at this file and there we go. Good quality, nice grain, etc. So while we're moving along, the um, next one would be a portrait. Um, portrait is a different size crop we use. Uh, let me just find a portrait that I can use. Oh, here we go. So portrait, we're going to crop. And this we're going to use a 4x5 uh, crop. Standard crop is 4x5. Um, and we want to make it a portrait. So we're going to go, there we go, 4x5. So there you see, nice 4 by 5 And again, we're going to export this to my desktop. But here's where the uh, little difference will come in. We've got a portrait. So over here, the short side, which is the width now, has got to be 1080, and you'll find the length is 1350. But Instagram in the width only allows you a maximum of 1080 pixels. So we click Export, and here we come. There's a nice little portrait for you beautifully orientated. Some of the more advanced crops that we use with um, Instagram is, let's have a look here, let's find a nice landscape. Here we go. They say for a uh, landscape orientated image we must use the 1.1 or 1 1.91 by 1 crop, so it gives you not quite a panoramic crop but that's what we use uh, for maximizing the space. And of course here we'll, ex we'll use the same export as the um, square because the minimum must be 1080, I mean the maximum must be 1080 in the width. So we ex export that and here we have the perfect landscape for Instagram, 1080 pixels on the long side. Now we get to the more uh, enjoyable part. We have what you may have seen online as sliced images, where you have one image which is made into two um, with um, um, with uh, with with uh, slicing the image. So we go to R, and the other crop. The first one we're going to use is a two by one crop. So two by one crop. We're going to slice it in Photoshop later. That would be a separate tutorial. So what we're going to do here is we're now going to export that one. Uh, so let's go to export. And now, remember I told you that the size, optimal size is 1080 pixels. Uh, what you need to remember now is because you want to get two photos out of one, you're going to use 2160, which is 1080 pixels times two. So when you slice it, you're going to have two images of 1080. So we export that one, and we quickly have a look here. It is on the desktop. It's not quite the same as the previous crop, but um, you'll see now when we slice this image what it looks like in, um, in Photoshop. So let's try one last one. Um, let's have a look at doing the... Um, you can do any number of slices, but for me I found that um, doing a, a two or a three crop slice uh, works best for me. Uh, let's have a quick look here. Um, yeah, sorry, there we go. So now we go to crop, original, we go to three by one. So it's a nice flat crop. 
and we will export that as well. But remember now we want three 1080 pixel wide images. So we've got to go and we've got to export this through 3240, which is three uh, divided by three gives you 1080. So there we go. There are the pixel sizes we use and there is the crop we use for uh, exporting images ready for processing in Instagram. I hope you enjoyed that tutorial. If you did, please like and share. And uh, I look forward to your comments in the, f uh, in, in the places below. Thanks very much. Have a great day.